another video, you guys. For those of you that are subscribed, y'all have been so sweet to me. I've been getting the most awesome comments and messages from you guys, and I really appreciate y'all reaching out to me and letting me know y'all are enjoying these. And for those of you that this is your first time watching, welcome, and I hope you'll join my little subscriber YouTube family and follow me along this flight attendant mommy journey thing of mine. Let me just tell y'all about today so far. So I was on wrap one. I was number three. So I knew I would get called and I was actually kind of surprised that it took them until 630 to call me, but they called me for a Beaumont, Texas overnight. Just one leg here. Super simple, but <laughs> not so much. And I meant to film an intro, but all of this went down when I wanted to. So this is going to be the intro, but anyways, get to our gate and the aircraft had come in from international. So it takes a lot longer for them to deplane. So I got to my gate on time, but unfortunately caused a little bit of a backup getting onto the plane. So once we finally got on the plane and boarded, they tell us that we're having AC issues and there's a leak somewhere. So it took them like 30 to 40 minutes to finally figure it out. And at first we weren't sure if we were gonna swap aircrafts or not, but I guess they fixed it. I served water, I was hot. I don't know if you can see right now, I'm still hot. Like they just patched it up and we left. So it was just a hot mess, literally. And finally at the overnight, tomorrow we have three legs. We do one leg back to Dallas and then a Corpus Christi turn. So I literally never leave Texas, but there is some weather coming in tomorrow, so we will see what happens. But for now, I'm just gonna chill, take a cold shower, and hang out. I am fat girl happy. Boom! It's going down. Yum! Grab some pizza from downstairs. Straight chilling from now on. So, we did not leave this morning, and we are here in Beaumont stuck until the weather blows over, and then they have us working a flight out tomorrow on Sunday at the same time that we were originally supposed to leave today at like 6 a.m. So, it's been pretty interesting. Yeah, we uh, checked my schedule last night, and actually my captain called me and I checked my schedule, and they had canceled everything that we had for today and we weren't sure at first what they were going to do and then once I refreshed my schedule again they just kept us here. I didn't bring any food with me because I really wasn't planning on being here that long. I was just going to snack and then be back today early but whatever because there's a local grocery store close by. It's called HEB and I love it and fortunately the van will take me there so fixing to go do that and <laughs> just hang out. It's like barely noon almost noon so just have all day to chill and watch tv and maybe edit this vlog a little bit so i picked up a few of these uh the chicken salad snack on the run little things by what is this bumble i don't know it's got a little bumblebee anyways these things are really good for on the go they're not the worst for you let's see so 140 calories, not the worst. I mean, probably a little bit of protein in there somewhere. Or, yeah, eight grams of protein, so not the worst. Um, <laughs> there's my pizza from last night. But uh, yeah, so I have that, and then I have a few things in the fridge, as well as some <laughs> Cap'n Crunch and some ice cream that I have in my little fridge over there. So just gonna snack and watching movies. Good morning. So it's like they figured, it's like crew scheduling figured, hey, she didn't work at all yesterday, so let's go ahead and work her really good today. I have five legs now. I go back from here to 
Dallas from Beaumont, finally getting out of this hotel room. And then I have two more turns on top of it. I think it's a Wichita Falls turn, which is in Texas, and then a Lake Charles turn as well. So, fun stuff. Um, there's not much more they can use me for after that because my duty day will be 12 hours at that point from start to finish and they can only extend me up to 14, which means they would have to have me in an overnight by in two hours, which could happen, but probably won't, we'll see. So I'm still good for more days, so we'll see what happens. Dallas. I'm in my car. I'm going to go to my crash pad. I'm on call tomorrow, but I am so far down on the list. I probably won't get used. At least that's what I'm hoping because I'd like to just chill and not have to do anything. And it wasn't until takeoff out of Beaumont that I realized something. I left my shampoo and conditioner in Beaumont. Like between mom brain, which is a real thing, y'all, and my flight attendant brain, which is also real. Uh, the first time I think I've left anything since training, probably, at a hotel. But it's okay, because they weren't that full anyways, so I'll just pick some more up when I go home this weekend. But thanks again for watching. Be sure to like this video if you enjoyed it, and I will see y'all next time.